Hello friends, in this lecture we will understand the concept of memory stack organization. That is the stack organization, how stack is implemented inside the memory, that is RAM. You can see here that RAM is actually divided into three sections. Number one, program or the instruction section. Number two, data or the operands. And number three, the stack. Here, the program section is that section in which all the instructions of programs which are presently in the queue to execute it to be executed are there whereas the required operands required data is stored in this particular section of the RAM and finally stack is also implemented inside the RAM basically in this section here DR is the register which is used to write some data inside the memory that is RAM or to read some data from the memory that is RAM. So DR which is the data register which is the special purpose registered register inside the MU part of the CPU. Here PC again one of the special purpose register which is used to hold the address of the next instruction which is going to be executed. AR that is the address register which holds the address of the actual operand and finally SP that is stack pointer again it is a special purpose register which is used to store the address of the stack actually this holds the top of the stack where the push operation or the pop operation needs to be performed we know that stack which is a data structure which is of LIFO type that is last in first out that is the element which is inserted at last inside the stack is the first one to be popped out to be read out from the stack. So here we use two different algorithms first one is for push that is for writing something inside the RAM and second one is pop that is for reading something from the RAM. So here SP is the stack pointer which is in which is decremented by one now here in this case stack pointer is decremented by one how here we start we start the insertion inside the ram from this particular position from the last position from the last memory word for example if i have inserted if i have pushed a inside this then a will be inserted at 4001 which is holded by the SP stack pointer again I just want to say that if some element is inserted inside the stack which is the stack portion of the RAM then stack pointer will be decremented by 1 now again if y, I want to insert something let's suppose I want to insert X now this X will be inserted at position 4000 that is one lesser position from the previous one. So in this way M of SP is the memory word is that address of the memory is that address of the RAM which is highlighted by which is pointed by the stack pointer. So at this position certain element which is inside the DR certain data which is inside the data registered will be written. So in this way an element can be inserted inside the RAM with the help of this push operation. Similarly if I want to read something out from the stack then first of all SP which is holding the top of the stack which is holding the top position of the stack will provide the data will provide the address and from that address of memory the element will be copied inside the DR that is data register that is that particular element will be read out from the memory RAM and will be provided to the DR that is data register after that the stack pointer is incremented by one finally if X is popped out from the RAM then this will be incremented by 1 now the next location of the stack pointer is 4001 
so now if again if i want to perform the pop operation now the stack pointer will point out at 401 so the next element which is to be popped out from the ram will be a so in this way you can see that stack works in the leaf of fashion that is last in first out here you have seen the stack implemented inside the ram whereas in the next lecture we will understand that how this stack is implemented inside the general purpose registers thank you